Hey guys and ghouls, it's Mansell here, and welcome back to another Monster High review. And today we're going to be checking out Clauding Wolf and her Ghoul to Wolf release. And Clauding, of course, is daughter of the werewolves, and she's been recommended for ages 3 and up. And in this release, you swish her tail to transform. So let's go ahead now, open her up, and check her out. And here we have the packaging with the Monster High logo going down the right hand side. At the bottom it says Ghoul to Wolf, Clauding Wolf, Daughter of the Werewolves, and she's been recommended for ages 6 and up. It also has this really clever lenticular picture of Clauding, and when you tilt the picture from side to side you can see her collar go up and down. And on the back we have the two simple instructions on how to make her collar go up and down. Also on the same line we have Draculaura who have also reviewed, and also thank you so much for checking this video out, it's had over 57,000 views. And there's a quick look at the packaging, so let's take her out of the box now, and then we can check her out up close. And here she is out of the box, and the first thing I notice she can easily stand up on her own. And these shoes also help her stand up on her own. And they're done in a purple and they're totally clawsome. They have claw designs there on the front. They're furry at the top. And the heels are in the shape of wolves. And here is Clauding up close. And she has this mechanism on top of her head which we'll be taking a look at shortly. But in the meantime let's check out her hair. Which is done in these really cute pigtails. It's done in her traditional brown with the purple streaks. And it's all curled there at the end. And she's wearing a purple eyeshadow to match the purple streaks in her hair. And we're moving on down to her outfit. And she's wearing this black bodice which is actually part of her body mold. It's made from a plastic and it's not removable. It also features a fur piece there at the top. With a half moon crescent brooch there in the centre. And I'll just zoom in on the bodice itself so you can see it better. It also features three gold zip designs and these purple leopard prints. And around her waist we have this wolf head. She's also wearing a gold necklace. And this is all moulded to the bodice. And moving down to her lower half she's wearing a purple skirt. And this is made from fabric and this is removable. It also features black overlock stitching on the top as well as the hemline. And the pattern includes full moon and half moon patterns on it. And underneath she's wearing black underwear. And this is a look at her collar from the back which is done in this beautiful gold. It's also in the shape of a heart and we have two wolves on each side. As well as two moons and some clouds. And this is what it looks like from the front. Again we have the two wolves on it. And this beautiful purple faux fur around the outsides. And this is what the collar, the mechanism as well as the mask look like from the back when they're in the down position. And hiding under her collar we have her purple tail, and when we swish it, the collar pops up. And the mask goes over her head and in front of her face. And it's totally beautiful. And it does also show you her tail up close, which is just made from a purple plastic. And we'll just stop for a second so I can show you this awesome new chocolate brought out by Whitakers. This is the Coconut Ice Surprise. And you can either get pink or blue. And you don't know until you open it up. And 20 cents from every block goes to help plunk it. And this is a special edition so it's not going to be around very long. And we're going to be opening up both these blocks. And again this is the Coconut Ice Surprise. Which is a white chocolate block with toasted coconut. And until you open it you don't know if you're going to get the pink or the blue. And as I also mentioned this is a special edition. So let's get them open and see what we get. And we have the pretty pink wrapping. Oh, and the first one we got is the blue one. But it's kind of a green colour really. And it's white on the bottom. And it looks super yummy, so we'll be trying that soon. And let's see now if we get the pink one. Oh, 
Oh, and we did. And it's so pretty. And again, it's white on the bottom. So there is the two different colours you can get. And to get these colours I kind of cheated, because on the back it has the ingredients. The pink one contains beetroot, and the blue one contains spirulina. And these are for the colouring. Now it's time to put it to the test and I'm going to taste it. So I'm going to start with this green one here. And I think I'll just grab two pieces to eat. <laughs> and it tastes amazing, and if you like coconut rough you're going to love this. I'm going to try the pink one now just to see if there's a different flavour. Again I'll grab two pieces. And they both taste exactly the same, but they're so yummy. And I think I'm going to end up eating both box because it's just amazing. Anyway, I'll try and save this for later, so let's get back and check out Claudine. Claudine also comes with a limited amount of articulation. You can't move your head, but her arms go from side to side. Her elbows go up and down. And her wrists also move. And her legs go up and down, and you can also bend your knees. Hey guys, that was a look at Claudine Wolf in Ghoul to Wolf from the Monster High line. And she's available from all good toy stockists. And again, she's been recommended for ages 6 and up. Let me know in the comments below what you think of her. She's definitely a doll for play, not to display. So she won't be going on display in my collection. But she is super fun if you want to have her to play with. Also, let me know if you've managed to find this chocolate. Again, it's only available in New Zealand, so you won't find it anywhere else. But I'm sure if you want to try it, you could buy it online. And that comes the end of my video. Hope you enjoyed it. Looking forward to reading your comments below. Love you, stay totally awesome, and I'll catch you in the next one. When you're down and you stare at your window, hoping that you'll come up with some words to say. That's not okay. When you feel like you're fed up with heartbreak. Can't take enough